In this lecture, we will talk about the little history, an overview of the features and structure of photo. My name is Muhammad Usman Awa, and I am teaching you the Odoo on the YouTube. I'm a digital social media and ERP expert. So let's talk about the history of Odoo. Well, Mr. Fabian is the founder behind this ERP. This ERP has a very interesting story. The father of Mr. Fabian has a small auction house business. So first he made this software for his father's auction house. At the time that was a little software. But now, yes right now, Odo is the number one open ERP in market. This is the big application suit ERP. Let's talk about the features of Odo ERP. Well, one one of the most important and most unique feature of Odo is that it's platform independent. As well as it has flexibility of data driven, which made it the number one amongst all other ERPs. One more interesting thing about Odo is that it has a modular approach and it has internationalization. Let me tell you that right now Odo is supporting more than 50 to 60 countries with more than 50 languages. It has a lot of local modules for all of the countries. It also have a support of CMS and e-commerce. It means that on the back end you will be running the open ERP, the business suit, but on the front end you will have a content management system and e-commerce. It means from on the front end you can sell products, you can display your website and on the back end you will be controlling all the transactions, all the products and each and every thing on the back end which is uh, the customer relationship system, accounting system, inventory system, a lot of other modules. Let's talk about the structure. Well, structure of Odo is MVC which is model view and control. Model here is the database which is storing everything in the back end. View is the front end. All the clicks, triggers and all the mouse actions all of them are driven by the view as well as controller is an ORM framework which is an API whichever call go from a trigger or a view or a mouse click the request will go to the controller it means that the server is the controller the request is calculated and the response is given back to the client this was the first lecture of photo I hope uh, you 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 got a lot of information about it thanks a lot for listening and don't forget to subscribe